What's going on guys? Joel Staley with joelstaleyfitness.com here and tonight I wanted to talk to you about the tricep. Now as you may or may not know, the tricep is made up of three different muscle heads. If you can see past my tattoos here, we have the lateral head right on the side of the arm. This big meaty portion on the back is the long head and you can see the medial head that rests underneath the long head right there peeking out at the bottom. Now to keep the anatomy lesson short, starting at the long head, which again is this big meaty portion back here, has an insertion point at the back of the scapula. This means you can get the greatest contraction and the greatest stretch in an overhead extension. Now this could be true with either a unilateral dumbbell extension overhead or using both arms at the same time, using an easy curl or barbell overhead extension or even using a cable overhead extension. Now moving on to the lateral head, which again is going to be this little portion on the side of your arm right here. You can imagine if an overhead movement works the long head, you're going to want to take the long head out of the equation, keep your arms by your side, and I recommend using a cable rope pull down. You're going to really want to emphasize the squeeze at the bottom portion of the movement, and that's going to really target the lateral head of your tricep. Now your medial head, which again lies underneath the long head of the tricep, is going to be worked in just about every exercise. If you want to place an extra emphasis on the medial head of the tricep, you're going to want to stick to your dips, whether it be weighted dip, body weight dip, or even a bench dip, or a closed grip bench press. Guys, if you're working hard, you got to be working smart too. If you're not seeing the results you want to see, please feel free to hit me up at joel at joelstaleyfitness.com. I'd love to help you out. Either way, we'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.